I am the skeleton. I need to support the body organs. I need to protect delicate structures. I need to allow for movement. So I need a tissue which is strong. That's what I want. I need a tissue which is strong. Not as strong as bone, let's say. A bit more flexible, but strong nonetheless to make up the trachea. And then maybe other parts of the larynx as well. <laughs> Every time the heart beats, I have to stretch. <laughs> you see, the left ventricle pumps 70 milliliters of blood that has to fit through narrow arteries. <laughs> we better be able to stretch to accommodate all this blood every heartbeat. <laughs> I remember that every time my aunt saw me, she would grab my cheek and tug it this way and say, you're so cute, or then tug it that way and say, you're so cute, or tug it a different way and say, you're so cute. And so in the dermis underneath my cheek, I need strength to go in this direction or that direction or every direction because I never know which way my aunt is going to grab my cheek and tug. All right, I need a tissue, and I got two jobs, and I got to get her done. I first... I got to take all the fluid that left the blood for some reason and didn't go back in the blood for some reason and I have to transport it to a place where I can get it back in the blood. So I need to transport fluid. Plus, I need to look for trouble. So preventing infection and cancer, well, that's part of my job. And so I just have to make sure I keep the body safe. So those are my two jobs I need to get done. I am under so much stress and responding to all of my stress hormones from my adrenal glands. I need to store energy. So I need a tissue which stores lots of energy, especially in response to stress. I find that just deep to my epithelial layer, I need a connective tissue which does a little bit of everything, which has some packing material, and has some white blood cells, and has some fibers for strength, and has some mast cells for inflammation, and, well, just a little bit of everything for a general packing material. That would be nice. Hello! As a fetus just coming into the world, I have so many things I need to do. I need to make arms and legs and organs. And, and what I need are very versatile cells which, which haven't decided who they want to be when they grow up yet. And that way I can give them instructions on what I need at a specific spot and what type of cell I need. And, and then they, they could can. become that cell with just the right abilities at just the place it's needed. That's what I need in a tissue. I need a tissue that I can use for tendons and ligaments. See, tendons and ligaments need to be strong, so I'm going to need some strong fibers. But since tendons and ligaments, like the ones which attach the muscle, the biceps to the arm, or attach the humerus of the upper arm to the bones of the lower arm, uh, the stresses tend to come from one direction. And so if the fibers in this tissue are all kind of going in the same direction, well, that I think works for me.